and welcome to Sunrise to Sunset News. Today we're here with Elizabeth and Stephanie and our first topic today is the weather. Over in Seattle, Washington, there's rain and the high is 50 degrees and the low is 42 degrees. And in San Francisco, California, it's very dry and the high is 62 degrees and the low is 44. And over in Toledo, the high is 40 degrees and the low is 26 degrees. And down in Kansas City, the high is 47 degrees and the low is 30 degrees. And up in Detroit, the high is 40 degrees and the low is 30 degrees. And over in Minneapolis, um, the high is 38 and the low is 24. And there's a mild spell over in there. And the, and the high is 76 degrees and the low is 60 degrees. So there's a big difference between that. And up by New York, it's chilly and there's some snowfall in Maine. And the high in New York is 46 degrees and the low is 32 degrees. That's the weather report across the nation. Now back to you, Elizabeth. Okay. Back to sunrise and sunset. And if you just tuned in, we just came back from a commercial break. And right, our next topic is deaths around the area. The obituaries. The obituaries. Louis W. Ash, age 92 years, of Pemberton, Ohio, died January 10, 2002. Keller Uts Cooch, funeral. From Ohio. <laughs> Sorry. John Olivia Herman, age 17, of Brander, Ohio, died January 9, 2002. Brandon Funeral Home, Wayne, Ohio. George Otto Witt, age 59 years, formerly of Bis Blissfield, Miami. Died January 10th, 2002. Tag School Funeral Home in Blissfield, Miami. Trivia Pursuit time. Thank you. The first caller that calls in and picks a topic will, um, wait, excuse me. The fifth caller that calls in will, um, and has the right answer to our question will win $10,000. And lines are open. Sunrise to Sunset News. Hi, this is Tammy, and I wanted to know if I was a fifth caller. No, I'm sorry. Sunrise to Sunset News. Hey, this is Eric. I wanted to know if I was a fifth caller, man. No, I'm sorry. You're the second caller. Thank you. Sunrise to Sunset News. Hi, this is Jessica, and I wanted to know if I was a fifth caller. No, I'm sorry, you're the third call. Sunrise to Sunset News. Hi, I'm Tammy Huffbauer, and I wanted to know if I was the fifth caller. I'm sorry, you're the fourth caller. Boom. Sunrise to Sunset News. Hey, yo, what's up? This is Alex. I wanted to know if I was the fifth caller, man. You are the fifth caller. Oh. <laughs> Your name is Alex, right? Yeah. Pick a topic. P, P, A, E, History, S, N, S, L, or W, C. History. Who predicted in the 50s that a man named Franco would provoke a civil war in Spain? For $100,000. Alex, we need an answer. Nostradamus. Exactly. You just won $100,000. Oh. You're our lucky oh. caller. Oh. Cool. You come onto the stage.
station anytime now, and we will. Okay, cut. If you come in the station anytime now, we will give you your one hundred thousand dollar check, and you can cash that in at any um bank. And that's all for our trivia pursuit. Better luck next time, everybody else. Our lucky caller today was Alex. Thank you. We're going to be pinning the, or taping, rather, the pictures that the children made onto the wall of the flag. And now to you, Elizabeth. And as we said, you will be seeing the pictures at the end of the show. And there will be a special music song that somebody wrote for the news channel for so we can kind of capture the moment of September 11th and it's written by Philip Johnny Bob and um good night and this was Sunrise to Sunset News thank you see you again thank you When I find myself in times of trouble, Mother Mary comes to me, speaking words of wisdom, let it be. On my darkest hour, she is standing right.